Hello everyone, it's April with Coasters and Castles Travel and I'm at Club Med Cancun, Yucatan. I'm so excited to check out this resort and show you our room and all around the resort and some adventures that we have. So stick with us and let's check this out together. And here is the lobby area. When you come in, you're greeted and you're given a bracelet, which is an RFID, and this acts as your room key, as well as to be able to have charging privileges while in the resort. It is all inclusive, but there certainly are some extra items that you can get. Uh, you can purchase items in the gift shop. There are some signature restaurants, which do have additional costs. There is a spa on property, and then certainly any excursions that you wish to purchase. Here is the Maya Theater, where you can come in, you can see that seats are socially distanced between groups. And they may have performances or show movies in here. So they do have an entertainment schedule going all day. And this is a family friendly resort. So they have activities for the kids, as well as for the adults. And here is an example of the activity schedule for the today, which is a Monday. It's very pretty. Here is a lounge. And here you can see the Discovery Center, which is for planning your excursions, so you can have some fun while you're visiting Mexico. There are different adventure parks around, and there's lots of things to see, depending on what your level of activity you want it to be. This is considered the center of the resort. So we have the lounge. At the top of the stairs, lots of seating, plenty of areas where you can sit and relax. And this is the entrance to La Hacienda, which is for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. That's the food court area. And we're going up to La Hacienda for breakfast. It does serve breakfast, lunch, and dinner at set times. And I just want to show you that you do have to climb a set of stairs in order to get up to the food court area. I'll show you some of the breakfast offerings for La Hacienda. So here's a detox juice bar, fresh, that you can choose. Assorted breads, these are help yourself. Bagels and muffins, here's some granola, raisins, cream cheese. cottage cheese. So they do have a lot of seating up here. And they do have kids clubs here. So while they're in the kids clubs, it looks like you can choose to have them get served a meal. There are hand sanitizing stations everywhere. And here is baby food, rice and pear for the little ones with the microwave. So that is a really nice treat. It is a family friendly resort. You get served, they've got Coke products for drinks. Everyone is very, very friendly. All right, here's some meats. Pork sausages, hash browns, bacon. And here's some cereals. It's funny to see cereal boxes in, you know, different countries. This yogurt station they did have set up all day, so it's nice that when you come in, if you can grab some yogurt, and you can always put it in your room because you do have a refrigerator in your room. And here's fresh fruits, and I imagine the fruit's gotta be amazing. And then there's juices to drink. 
So I'm not sure if that's jello. I think that's jello. His Mexican sauces, boiled eggs, more condiments. And of course I did try some ice cream because you know you have to do taste tests. The ice cream was very good. Not available right now but that's okay. And here's a sort of bread station again. Oh, and there's some donuts and pastries. So they do have elevators, so you can get up to the second floor for La Hacienda, so you can have your meals, which is a really nice thing. Otherwise, there's stairs if you'd like to take the stairs and have a little bit of exercise. And La Bodega is one of the signature restaurants for guests and you do need to make reservations. La Estancia is also the steakhouse on property and that's the second signature restaurant and equally you do need to make reservations and they do fill up very quickly. And I want to show you we're going to be checking out La Estancia, the steakhouse. It does have outdoor seating with amazing views. And certainly indoor air-conditioned seating as well and when you get into the resorts it's really important that you go to reservations and you book any dining reservations you want for your stay because they do fill up very quickly can't emphasize that point enough very quickly be sure to make it once you come in with reservation or with your concierge, depending on where you're staying. And the infirmary. So important. Should you have any issues, they can help to take care of you. Of course you have a gift shop which has Club Med logo items as well as some Mexican items. So La Boutique. Simple and that is open 9 to 10 p.m. It does have some sundries in there and some toiletries so should you need something they probably have it in the store. And lots of things for family of all ages. And here's Centro de Photo. So if you wish to have a photo session, they're happy to help you. So great if you're taking that family trip or even you're here on your honeymoon, you can get some special pictures. They do offer scuba diving on property. So here's a scuba store and a fun craft store. I haven't had a chance to look in there yet, but I can't wait. And then, of course, the jewelry store. And here is a specialty shop. And here is the spa, the outside of the spa. So you can see, we're gonna try that out. You know, research, of course. And the fitness center. Here is the relaxation area of the spa. They do have assorted treatments that you can choose from. And there's a steam room that you can take advantage of if you have one of the treatments. They do not have any hydrotherapy on property. And again, it is okay to drink water on property as long as it's not the tap. So you can't drink from the tap, but they have plenty of water that they can serve you take advantage of. And here's more of the relaxation area. But 
beds where you can just kind of sit and it's quiet other than the sound of the water. Very lovely and you can see the lagoon. And there's a resort on either side. And this water does have crocodiles in it, so this is not the water that you swim in. We did see a baby crocodile. There's a lot of wellness opportunities at the resort. They do have assorted fitness classes. We saw cycling and Zumba and yoga. So however you'd like to enjoy, you're welcome to. And this is one pool area. So you have La Saluna, the lounge. And the second floor of La Hacienda. And you find that the water is actually cool, but I'm not always a great judge because I prefer the water to be bath water. And they can have live music playing. Oh, they're doing dance lessons right now. So that's fun. I saw on the menu they had salsa lessons. And you can see the beach. They do have volleyball. And we're at the beginning of Hotel Row in Cancun. There's a lot of seaweed here. We did see them working hard to try to clean it up and they still are down the end. But that's going to be a tough task every day to clean up the piles of seaweed. So it's still rough water today. It's not safe to go in the water. And here's an overview of the pool area. Now when you check in, they give you towel cards. So cards you use to check in and check out the beach towels. So here's the stand for the bar, the crepery, which has some fun snacks. Crepes and fruit and some sandwiches, salads, french fries, popcorn. And that is open, I think it's 10 to 6.30 each day. <laughs> Hopefully I can show you this without blinding you, but there's a beautiful rainbow circling above us. Perfect for our welcome to Mexico. Just want to show you some of the kids clubs, the petite club and the mini club. So I club men, kids under four are included with the reservation. So there is an additional cost to the petite club. But kids over four are additional on the reservation. So the mini club is included. And how fun does this look? I'd love to play in here, never mind the kids. Every day uh, when they finish activity, the mini club staff comes back and sanitizes their place. And every Saturday. So it's cleaned every day, but every Saturday it gets a deep cleaning. So Saturdays the kids' club is closed because of COVID. So there used to be more activities in the rooms, but with COVID it's limited activities. And you can see some more of the activity rooms. You have separate rooms to try to break up the age groups a little bit, but they do try to get the kids outside as much as they can for health-wise and of course with COVID considerations. So, but if the weather's bad, there's plenty of room in here to keep the kids excited. Now they do have some extra activities during the resort. There's hammocks over here that you can lay on. And there's a bocce ball court to entertain yourself. And one really unique activity is a trapeze school.
fun is that? That's something really different. Here's some little sitting areas where you can gather. That looks like there's a screen there, so maybe they play some films. Probably in busier times. It's still COVID, so it is reduced capacity still here. That's a poker table. Not too many resorts you can come and try out a trapeze. I don't think we're going to be trying that because I don't think it'll end well. So here's another fun activity. So if you'd like to test your skills, you can try out archery here at the resort. And this is all for families. Another unique activity of the resort is you can choose to go water skiing. And they will teach you so you can start at zero level experience, which that would be me. And they're very patient and they show you some simulations while you're on land and then they are very gentle with you to tell you what to do and how to improve yourself as you're going around. So that's a lot of fun. This is adults only, 18 years of age or older. And you can't snorkel while you're on property. It's really windy right now, so hopefully you can hear me. They give you fins and life vests. people snorkeling they're just getting out of the water now so they give you the snorkel and the mask and fins and a life vest to use here's an example of some of the fish you might potentially see now you see this is the area that you will snorkel in the water is a little less rough today than it was yesterday but it's too deep here it is a controlled area that they have you snorkel in but there's lots of species that, of fish that you can see and here is the exclusive building the concierge jade that's kind of in the middle of the property and here you can see there are tennis courts there's plenty of active activities here which is really nice if you're into wellness and with the archery and the trapeze that you can do that still blows my mind not many resorts will offer that there's tennis they've got fitness classes going all day the water classes that are going on there's beach volleyball pool volleyball there's plenty to do how here we're inside Takuate. You know, again, wellness is big. I've seen a lot of detox bars for juices, lots of healthy eating, and lots of fun eating. You can see there's lots of fresh fruits. Crepes are big. Waffle sticks. Oh, those look really good. Plenty of meats, of course condiments, or whatever you need, and fresh juices, yogurts, and I love they've got different samplings of baby food on property. Uh, this is family friendly, so family friendly all inclusive, the little ones can enjoy as well. Thank you. And you can see this. The beverages, there's purified water, so the water is safe to drink that whatever is being served. You don't drink from the tap water. And the ice is also purified. There's juices, coffees, and sodas. 
is such a fun building. More pastries. And here's the beach lounge. And of course the bartenders can offer various adult beverages as well as non-alcoholic. How cool is that? I love that. It must be so pretty at night lit up. Now this is lovely. You can see the pelicans sitting on the coral. Beautiful water. It's much calmer here. And they do have assorted water sports and you can see that the buildings for Club Med do extend pretty far down. And it looks like down the end of the little hut is the dive center. So you can get patty certified here. This is fun. You can choose to do a mangrove tour. There's lots of little river, rivers through the mangroves here. You can't swim in them because you'll be swimming with assorted other critters but it is fun. And here's the excursion shop. Oh, and look at him. Isn't he pretty? Oh, oh, he's trying to get into the store. You can't go shopping, bud. And another iguana. They're everywhere. I guess even the locals like to shop here. He's waiting to get in, but it's not open yet. Look at him. So pretty. And here's a playground for the kids. And here's the water sports check-in. So you can do paddle boards, kayaking, or sailing. You can see that they have sailing lessons, and they have a teens club and a mini club. That's fun. And now we're coming up to the other pool. Got these fun sunbeds to rest on basically an infinity pool to the ocean and of course a bar and a popcorn cart that's fun and a little splash area for the kids you really can't beat this view overlooking the beach. I hope you enjoyed seeing Club Med Cancun Yucatan as much as I did. What a great resort. Definitely high activity, lots of fun things to do, great for the family, activities for all ages. I highly recommend you come here. Thank you to Club Med for inviting us out and to be able to check out this beautiful resort. Be sure to check out our other videos so you can see more rooms as well as more of our adventures. Thanks for stopping by. Have a great day.